Hello everyone, welcome back to Shock Mania and the Arty Dance YouTube channels. We are going to take a look at an Indonesian movie that's about to come out, or might have just come out, called The Redemption of Sin. However, the Indonesian title is Tebusan Dosa. I hope I've pronounced that right with this awful voice. Um, as always, it's a, 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 you know, a very, what am I trying to say? You know what? Who cares what I'm trying to say? Let's check out the trailer. Maaf Mbak, pencarian harus kita hentikan. Kalau kami menduga, jasadnya itu sudah terbawa jauh. I'm sorry about the lack of subtitles. Sudah seminggu anak saya Nirmala hilang. So, from the producer of Exuma, which is um, that Korean film. I haven't seen it, but apparently it's really, really good. Um, so the story behind this one is the woman's looking for her kid who went missing after a bike accident. This is a very slow trailer. By the way, I'm guessing it's going to build up. I don't know. I I'm looking at this so far, and of all the Indo horror films coming out this year, this one does have a very slow feeling to it to start off with. It seems to be common with Indonesian trailers that are really slow to start up and then build up towards the end. The main actress looks familiar. But the name doesn't ring a bell. She's from Primbon, that's why. Ah, and she's from Grave Torture. Hmm. Grave Torture, which is a film that we looked at recently. Um, I don't know about this one. I'm usually, I'm, I'm usually I'm fairly in the middle when it comes to Indonesian horror films. I'm either really into it or really not into it. I don't think I'm too much into this one, but let's check out what the synopsis is about. Maybe that can convince me a bit more. Waning, a mother, experienced a tragic event when her 11-year-old daughter, Nirmala, went missing on a motorbike accident on a bridge. The accident also claimed the life of Yutiya, Wenning's mother. Wenning feels very guilty for making her mother die. I don't think you made a mother die. And her child washed away in the river, but she believes Namali still, Namala is still alive. Tirta, a female mystery podcast creator, which I think that is... Um, no, it's a different person. Um, oh, where am I up to? Uh, is keen to publicize Winning's tragic life, but her help leads Tuta to uncover the dark secrets of Winning's past that led to Manala's disappearance. Ooh. So there's a bit of mystery behind this one. With all her efforts and hope, Winning searches for Namala, including asking Tetsuya, a researcher from Japan, for help, Wenning also enlists the health of Mbagoa, a mysterious shaman. You know what? This synopsis is just giving away the whole film. Why don't you just tell me what happens at the end? However, in the midst of her search, Wenning is always visited by UTR's ghost. Will Wenning reunite with Namala? That synopsis has kind of just ruined the film for me. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I feel like I already know what the whole film's about. All jokes aside, excuse me, all jokes aside, I think I'm still keen. On, I think I'm starting to get keen yeah, on checking this one out. Only for the pure fact that I do like Indonesian horror. But that trailer hasn't really sold me too much. But what about you? Has it sold you? Are you interested in Redemption of Sin, also known as Temple Santosa? Um, there's a couple of other trans translations for the name. Atonement of Sin or Expirations of Sin. But Redemption of Sin seems to be the official title that this movie is going for. I am the Arty Dance. You are watching Shock Mania and the Arty Dance YouTube channels. Thank you for tuning in as always. If there are movies that you think I should check out, I'm always keen for recommendations. So leave them below. Otherwise, I'm going to catch you next time.